Assalamu alaikum. Okay, for today's hack, I have my handy dandy drill, which I use for everything. It's um, by Black & Decker. If I could have found it in pink or purple, lime green, or baby blue, I probably would have grabbed one of those. But anyway, um, on here I have this obviously worn out sandpaper because I was using this as a sander. I literally use this for multiple purposes. And I'll probably make a video on how I clean a pot with this, a burn pot that is. Anyway, today's hack is going to be how to um, replace the sandpaper without having to buy these for $5 at Lowe's. I think it's, yeah, it's $5 you get the sander, uh, like a foam brush, and I think a soft brush. But I really just needed the foam paper. I mean the um, sandpaper. So I bought a pack of this is a sandpaper set. Um, it has 12 sheets of paper in it, sandpaper in it. And I bought this at Walmart. I bought it a long time ago. Like, I want to say over a year ago now. Possibly two years now. So anyway, um, I have my sheet of sandpaper. I'm going to take this off. This can be tricky or just hard to take off. I'm going to try to unwind it. Yeah, like that. Okay. Trying to get it off. And it's playing me. So I'm just going to take this off, see the screw, all of that comes out, this is the, the back plate, the screw, and the washer that holds it in. And this is all used up, I use it for so many things, so I'm going to trash that, and I'm just going to use one, lay it flat down on one corner of the paper, that way I can um, do it multiple times, or reuse it multiple times, it may not fit all four. But I'll get multiple uses out of it. Anyway, then I'm just going to take the pencil, trace around it. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not going to fit all four. But I can put at least three on here. Circles. I'm going to cut the other two out in a minute, but I don't have to record that right now. In the center of this, there is like a, a hole. It actually was a slit with a hole in the middle. And I would have to go get my hole punch right now. But I can just do this, slit it, and then fold it again. Slit it. That should be sufficient. I'm going to sit it right back on here on the plate. Stick the screwdriver. And stick it all right back in here. I'm gonna switch settings, and bam, we can sand whatever you need to sand. And that, my friends, is how you can hack it without having to pay five dollars for just one of these. You can have multiple, like I said, this has 12, this has 12, um, sandpaper sheets in it, and I managed to cut out three on here, and you can, I use sandpaper for everything, so I like to do a lot of DIY projects, and, um, 
This is really, really handy. It's super cool. So give it a try. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you later.